Southern Rail Fan is the place for amazing videos of all types of trains. Southern Rail Fan, subscribe today. Okie dokie, good Sunday morning to you. I guess it'll be Sunday evening by the time you see this video. We're at uh, starting our day off at Moody Town. We're catching a southbound man. This is X653. Uh, and uh, I just heard him set the defect detector off. He's not a very big train, less than 3,000 feet. Uh, and I haven't had a chance to check through everything and see what else might be going on today. We did miss the uh, uh, ethanol train last night with the uh, Union Pacific and Kansas City Southern unit on it. And we missed the uh, uh, 653 yesterday with the military equipment on the rear end of it. But that's quite all right because uh, another shout out to the maintenance of way for uh, saving us from, uh, it could have been bad. They got everything taken care of and those trains got to running and they came through Marion uh, after 10 o'clock last night. But uh, we'll see what I want to catch today and we'll start out with this southbound X653. It's early in the morning, there's not really a good sunny spot anywhere here. southbound crews uh, to get their rest to take him north so we may be able to catch him today you never know alrighty we're back at Moody Town catching this northbound man I'm assuming this is gonna be the M694 isn't it weird how summertime rain works right up there at that white uh, post there on the side of the road it's pouring the rain we're all right right here but I've got the old train tracker 2000 in position. If I need to get in the door to finish filming, we can do that. Yep, this looks like it's going to be the M694. 
$6.94. Cool. that DPU was just in idle I'm assuming now we may catch a northbound M652 and there's also a possibility I know the uh, northbound empty ethanol train B650 went on duty sometime today in Charlotte and of course you have to come to Bostic and then get a crew for from Bostic coming north but I think they're short on northbound crews so We'll just have to keep our ear out to the scanner and keep watching Facebook and see what else we can see today. Okie dokie. <clears throat> we picked out Jacktown for this afternoon. Uh, we're waiting on a combination of B666 and B650. They combined those two trains at uh, Bostic to come north. He was called at uh, 315. It's about 3.30, 3.45 now, so I want to come on over just in case uh, uh, for some reason I didn't hear the uh, defect detector or something. And I'll spin around here. I don't know if you can tell, but eh, the sky's looking boogery back there. It's been a miserable day. It's uh, rained for about 35 seconds to, to a couple of minutes and then heat right back up. It's done that several times, and right now it's just kind of a a heavy mist and it's just the humidity is is like I said it's rough on old fat man but we're gonna hang out here and wait on this huge empty northbound ethanol train should be over 10,000 feet and uh, both of those trains had foreign power B666 had uh, Union Pacific or BNSF power and the B650 had Union Pacific power so I'm almost certain they'll leave those locomotives on. It, it'll be interesting to see how they've got it set up, but we're, we'll definitely hang out here at Jacktown and catch this northbound man. Alrighty, here we go. It's gonna be interesting to see how they've got this train set up. This is uh, two different trains combined, 756 axles, over 11,000 feet.
was awesome. Oh, that was awesome. All right, that'll be the last train uh, on this video. So you guys have a good evening, and we'll see you tomorrow.